Hey guys, Coach Travis here, and today I'm gonna go over a nice hip mobility flow for more specifically the squat in itself. So we're gonna start out easy peasy in a squat, standing up, shoulders about hip width apart, sink down nice and low. Big thing here, just try to keep your feet flat. Not a lot of rules, we're just here to have a little bit of fun, loosen up the hips a little bit. So from here, <clears throat> we're gonna work on a little rotation. We'll take one knee down to the turf and then right back. This is the point where you can take your heel up and just give a little tap right there. We'll work around that rotation of the hip and we'll just alternate. One side, you can do one or two, maybe 10 each side. Ooh, put your hand down, you lose your balance a little bit. Easy peasy right there. Then we'll place our hands down and then we're just gonna reach up for the sky with one hand at a time. We're gonna squeeze our arms up against inside of our knees, push those knees out a little bit then, reach up nice and high. Easy back down, no need to rush. Just pay attention, focus on what's going on, be aware of where you're tight and breathe. Very big part of this, making sure that you're getting air into the joints, making some space, and just calming down a little bit. Try to reach up as high as you can, keeping that arm as straight as possible, and you're gonna be fighting the urge of this knee to follow with it. You wanna push against, so we can open up the hips and that T-spine at the same time. Next part, we get the hammy some love. We're just gonna place our hands down, maybe grab the toes, and take our hips to the sky. Ooh if you have some tight hammies, you may not be able to straighten the knees very much, and that's fine. Just take notice. Maybe there's one side tighter than the other. You just want the hips up as high as possible. Knees as straight as possible, pulling yourself down and then sinking down nice and low. And if you wanna open up the hip flexors a little bit, those hands go back down, jump the feet back, and a little uh, step through, groin your action. Open up this hip flexor, you can march it back, bring the other one up, easy peasy, jump both feet up, and you're back in your squat. So go through those, you have the rotation, we have the knee taps, we have the overhead reach, the high knee hike, Whoop. and then our step through. Have some fun with it folks. Again, there's no real set reps or sets or anything like that. Just find some tight spaces, spend some time there, give it a shot, see how it feels. Thank you so much for watching and uh, let me know what you think in the comments below.